Yahoo's popular email service is getting a long-promised facelift. It's part of the internet company's attempt to appeal to people who are increasingly using Facebook, Twitter, Google, and other online alternatives to communicate. With the changes, people can post updates to Facebook and Twitter accounts from their Yahoo email and can chat with people logged into Facebook. The service is also supposed to be two times faster. About 277 million users of Yahoo's free email will be switched to the new version during the next few weeks. And Toyota wants you to friend your car. That's right, friend your car. The Japanese automaker is launching a social network allowing drivers to interact with their cars on Facebook, Twitter, and a new private social network called Toyota Friend. Low on uh, battery power, your car can tweet you directions to the nearest uh, service station. The service will roll out first in Toyota's electric vehicles and plug-in hybrids starting in 2012 in Japan. Toyota drivers will be able to access the network from the mobile phones, car dashboards, and computers. Lady Gaga fans were excited to learn they could download her new album, Born This Way, from Amazon.com for only 99 cents. But they were soon disappointed as technical problems set in. Customers received a busy signal when they tried to download the album. A spokeswoman says Amazon experienced a high volume of traffic that caused delays for those downloading the album. The company has since arranged for customers who ordered the album yesterday to still purchase it for 99 cents. As we head to break, a program a programming change to tell you about. Dr. Phil is changing times. You'll be able to watch The Good Doctor at 10 a.m. and 4 p.m. We're also launching our inaugural show, Cron 4 News, at 8 p.m. And the changes begin Monday, May 30th. We'll be right back.